Hey, this is Nick with The Happen Group. Uh, today we're going to cover slip trips and falls, uh, what are some of the causes, and what can we do to prevent these types of accidents. Slip trips and falls make up the majority of general industry accidents. Uh, they result um, in back injuries, uh, contusions, fractures, broken bones, and in some instances they can cause death. Slip usually happens when your foot loses traction with the walking surface. For instance, if you slip on ice uh, or a wet, uh, slippery surface, um, these usually occur on the same level and they're the most common accidents in the workplace. A trip usually occurs when your foot strikes an object, however your upper body continues to move forward. Um, this results in loss of balance. A fall is generally an uncontrollable descent. Um, this occurs when an individual loses their balance. Uh, you have two types. You can fall from an elevated surface or on the same level. Now that we're familiar with slip trips and falls, let's take a look at some of the common causes. Having obstructions in our walking path. Not paying attention to where we're walking. Not using handrails when ascending and descending stairs. In the workplace, uh, improper storage of materials, equipment, tools leaving cords and other items unattended in a walking area, poor housekeeping practices, uneven sidewalks. Uh, this is a common occurrence um, and this can pose a serious hazard for pedestrians. So it's important to look where you're walking, especially walking around in a common area where sidewalks may be damaged or there may be a change in elevation. Always be careful when walking in grassed areas. Uh, you never know if there's a hole being covered with grass or other material or vegetation. Walking in areas where standing water is present. During winter time, walking on icy surfaces. Walking with bulky items that obstruct your vision. So how do you avoid slip trips and falls? First, always look where you're walking. In the workplace, always keep your aisles and walkways clear and free of obstructions. Always store items and materials properly. Uh, try to avoid leaving them out in the walkway or protruding into the path of egress. Um, usually, if you do so, um, someone can strike their foot on it and uh, could cause an injury. Always pay attention to where you're walking. Uh, that way you can observe changes in elevation. Always remember to use handrails when walking up and down flights of stairs. Uh, in the event that you trip or fall, um, holding onto the handrail can stop you from getting injured. Avoid walking down dark corridors or aisles. Um, always try to make sure that these areas are illuminated. Install track off mats at entry door locations. Always wear slip resistant shoes when performing work activities. And finally, always clean up spills when they happen. As always, thank you for watching and feel free to subscribe for more health and safety videos.